number one. Harold, you notice know against this defense, you got to have a guy out on the perimeter be an absolute dude. Christopher talked about uh, Stidham and the performance of the Raiders. Devontae went absolutely off. DK last week had the big play down the field on Ward. Dak could have a really good game. Dak could go. You mentioned something good, Dan. Dak you, could go you, you 24 mentioned that of 32. I know he could go 24 of 32. You know he could what? throw for 260 this, and have a Dan. good game, but not have a ton of big time this. plays. CeeDee Lamb's got to be the guy. He's got to be a difference maker on the out. He has to play his best game. Dan, That's who has to this. do it. Can I answer something? Yeah. Name me a receiver in playoff football who's had a big game and a quarterback played poorly in the same game. Doesn't happen. Plaxico Burris set the nice. a championship game record against Green Bay, against the Packers. The second run, the first run for Manning. Manning played a tremendous game. Obviously, Devontae Adams a couple of weeks ago, Stidham played a great game. You are not going to have the receiver go out there and be awesome and the quarterback be mediocre. It, one Who goes said hand that in that hand for Brandon mediocre. Where is this coming from? Oh, good. I, but this is semantics. Mediocre. You said great. he didn't He's have to play, play great. He's a very good game for them to win. Game you said throw. he didn't have to play great. No, I didn't. I said he you doesn't just said have it, to Dave. play his best game. What I said is Dak, yes, of course, like Dak's going to have to music. play well. Mediocre but, team in Big D. What'd you say, Miles? But Dan, you I feel like mentioned, we need the theme music. See, Accident waiting to happen. Mediocre team in Big D. Dan I mentioned that, that I know, and and Dan knows that I know because see, I played in a lot of meaningful playoff you games. Sure did. A lot of meaningful playoff ga games, Dan. I, I can't say the same. Uh, no, <laughs> no pun uh, intended. I can't say the same. I played in a lot of meaningful playoff uh, games, Dan, in which you have not. So you right. I would know. Harold. I would know going against a top defense. Harold. I would know on what you need to do from an offensive standpoint to be the top defense. You right, Daniel. And now my name is Harry because I'm one and you're zero, Daniel. That's not winning an argument. That's taking a low blow. That's unnecessary. <laughs> the reality is this. If you go back to that Seattle game last week, did DK Metcalf play great? Yes. Okay. Did Geno Smith play well? Not it's well enough. It's semantics, Dan. Not well enough. I mean, yeah, you're making a big – there's not that much of a difference between playing well and playing their best game. It's a – you can argue what, what – what you can argue the quality of a best game uh, of a Dalton. quarterback all day. No, Dalton, so, no, 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 no. You're right. Gino was playing well. Played well in the game. Until he fumbled that football oh, that's a good in point. the red zone. And then through right. yourself. He wow. was playing great until he fumbled that football in the okay. red zone. So, so, so guess just what? to clarify, the just quarterback to clarify. has to play great okay. against the San Francisco 49ers that's if not, you're going to beat them. So just to clarify, Dak needs to play in your guys' minds, he needs to play better than he did last week for Dallas to win. In my eyes, Dak needs to play great. Now, if that's better than last week, I don't know. I don't know what that is. He needs to play great, though. Right, he can't have playoffs. a drop off of in his play. Of course, he's got to play great. Okay. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube for live streaming, sports, and premium content. Subscribe to ESPN Plus.